Hello Satch, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what are your important general love messages. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Sagittarius today. Show me more. Okay, let's see. We've got the Three of Cups. This was the first card that came out that could indicate a reconciliation for some of you or a celebration. Uh, we've got the Four of Wands here. However, this is like such opposites. Opposites. So happy, so bright, and then doom 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 to the hermit and the five of pentacles and then ten of cups and with the king of cups here in an upright position all right so i do sense that the hermit with it being in an upright position and in the middle of the spread here i feel like this could indicate somebody feeling torn between two here three of cups should i reconcile should i be with this person or should i ten of cups here in reverse or should i come let it go or break it off okay for some of you you are separated from this person or for some of you you can also be just going through some serious issues right now with your person because it looks like the hermit this card definitely indicates somebody feeling like they need to really reflect they need time to reflect to soul search and to make sure that they're being very wise with the actions that they are going to take it does look like somebody could be thick um, thinking about taking actions towards you or you towards your person again roles can be switched in this reading okay so five of pentacles here this there's a sense of loneliness okay loneliness because the hermit can be quite lonely for some of you Sag, you could be in a relationship and but yet still feel lonely okay just for a very small portion of you i would say about two percent of you but Five of Pentacles here also, it could, to me, it's like walking away, walking away. The way the cards are interacting here, it's like these two people are walking away from the Four of Wands. For some of you, uh, issues with finances could be, uh, could, um, could come between the two of you, okay? I do see multiple uh, messages here, uh, such you just take what resonates with you. But Spirit is definitely saying that with the King of Cups here, the, the love is there, okay? This could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. If you wonder if somebody loves you, this person does love you, okay? However, the Ten of Cups is in reverse. For some reason, there's this uh, mindset, this mindset of somebody feeling like, I don't deserve love. And this is why, one of the main reasons as well, this could have caused some issues in your relationship with this person but overall ten of cups here in reverse can indicate a separation and the hermit and the five pentacles could also indicate these three cards actually indicate um, a lot of you could be going through a separation with somebody feeling left out in the cold here okay the hermit usually ap appears after a breakup or a separation but initially it was happy with the three of cups and the four ones but i sense most likely someone is could be missing you or you could be missing somebody here definitely thinking long and hard in regards of a reconciliation getting back together four ones could also indicate that hmm. all right let's see more a little bit i don't know why there is a little bit of a self-sabotage energy here as well okay somebody may feel like they don't deserve this person's love um could be you feeling this way or your person feeling this way so six of cups is right here a return from somebody from your past or you could be thinking about returning to somebody from your past but Six of Cups could also indicate a sense of nostalgia. I do sense a lot of missing energy here, as in somebody is missing somebody here terribly, okay? So the Knight of Swords here, this may indicate um, a little bit of a, an energy of somebody feeling kind of angry, okay? A little bit hostile. But if it's not that, it could just indicate somebody wanting to communicate 
fast, okay, as soon as possible. But maybe in regards of returning here, but with the Queen of Swords here in reverse, that you could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, can be any sign, strong Virgo I'm seeing here as well. And also some uh, five signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. But the Queen of Swords is in reverse and the Eight of Pentacles is in reverse. I feel like somebody could be feeling uh, a lot of resentments or holding a lot of grudges towards you or you towards them. And Eight of Pentacles in reverse indicates somebody stop working on this connection, retrieve their cup of love here with the Queen of Cups in reverse. Somebody is also angry that somebody is not is no longer invested in this connection or refuse to invest as much as they used to. Ace of Wands in reverse can indicate a new beginning. I feel, um, I feel like the only problem such, you see the f pentacles here, the Eight of Pentacles is in reverse and the Five of Pentacles is in an upright. So Five of Pentacles is not the best card for it to be in an upright uh, position, but and Eight of Pentacles would have been good, but it's in reverse. So I would say lack of stability or an offer that someone may refuse because they just don't think that it is good enough, okay? And that, because the cups are there though, I would say the love is there for sure. But lack of stability, for some of you, it could be because of money. For some of you, it could be because of mm, commitment issues or some sort of stability that I'm getting here, okay? And such, it's real whenever, um, you know, number one reason of m a lot of couples, um, they get a divorce or separated because of money issues. I feel like for some of you, this could be uh, one of the issues for some of you, not all of you, okay? If not, just generally eight of pentacles in reverse indicates somebody not, not wanting to work on this connection anymore. Five Pentacles, someone feeling that they are being left out in the cold. But also there is a willingness that I'm getting here because it right, it's right next to the King of Cups. So there's a bit of a sweet, very sweet energy here with the Four Wands as well. So because it's surrounded by these two pretty positive cards, I would say with the Five Pentacles, someone is actually willing to go through the storm with you, okay? But right now, there's definitely trouble in paradise with the Ten of Cups here in reverse. And Two of Pentacles in reverse indicates a choice that somebody could have made in the past. Again, these two aces are in reverse, right? Either they are being rejected, offers are being rejected, or offer that is being delayed because somebody is needing a lot of time to think here with the Hermit, okay? Five of Swords is in reverse and the High Priestess in reverse. Hmm. I do sense an energy of somebody feeling that they need to make sure that they're making the right decision, right? The high priestess in reverse also can indicate secrets being revealed uh, in regards of somebody being underhanded here with the foul swords here in reverse. Underhanded, it could be in any way, shape or form. may not always mean cheating or lying, but it could be as well. But the five of swords in reverse just also indicates somebody not wanting to play mind games anymore, no longer want to you know, fight for this connection anymore. They, so they just made a choice to let go of this connection, all right? Ah, uh, Satch, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm gonna leave you with a playlist on the screen right now. This is the playlist from my second vlog channel. If you're interested, check it out. And also, I'm open for a personal reading. If you guys would like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And such, I post your videos almost every single day. If you would like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. All right, take care, Satch. Bye.